My name is Richard Whittlestone. I'm a professional wildlife artist, and this is my gallery here on the Chatsworth Estate in the heart of the Peak District. My exhibition is on. Come on inside. So here we are in the uh, in the gallery. As you walk through the door, you'll see my limited edition prints. Uh, there's also greetings cards, all taken from original paintings of mine. It's not only my gallery, it's my studio, uh, and visitors can see me at work and a painting in progress. This is the main gallery. It houses a selection of my original paintings. Uh, of which this one is the most recent. It's a painting called Mob Rule, uh, a tawny owl being pursued by a host of smaller birds. Um, this year being the strange year that we've all experienced has had the uh, advantage in a way of affording me more time to uh, spend on a painting like this. More time in, in the fact that I've put the detail in the wing tips, which I don't normally do, I usually blur them to give an idea of speed. Whereas in this painting, I've stylized it slightly. As you can see, there's two wrens here, uh, always the noisiest birds in the woodland. Um, the jay is pulling the tawny owl's tail. I've never seen that happen in reality, but I used to have a tame magpie that pulled the uh, farm cat's tail, so they could probably do the same sort of thing in my mind. The background is a huge part of this painting. Um, it's painted in such a way with broad, quick brush strokes as to give the movement to the birds, which means I can put more detail into the birds' uh, wing feathers. So although they look stylized, they do look as though they're moving. Don't forget the little fly, of course, which is in here. I put him there, so he's part of the uh, part of the journey. And as an artist, I cannot help but be inspired by the amazing scenery that uh, surrounds the gallery, from the high moorlands to the parklands, and all the animals and birds that can be found there. And it's this particular painting for me that best illustrates the beauty of the natural landscape that surrounds a gallery and why so many people choose to visit.